yeah, you soon learned. You had to learn a certain amount. Yeah, some of those old miners, that's all they had done. They had never done nothing else. They had just mined. A lot of those, I can remember those. And Babe Dominguez's stepdad, and all them, and the Hernandez's and the Sarianos, and a lot of them, all their family ever done was work in the mines. Yeah. Connie that's in here, her husband died here since I've been here. Uh, Carrillo's? Yeah. And they come over from uh, Jerome in 1952 when Jerome closed up and come to work at the mine. So I, I talk to Connie every day. I did talk to her husband when he was alive here. But uh, Jesse Bias, he come over from uh, uh, Jerome. Good miners. They was all excellent miners. Very good miners. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jesse, he's gone. All, all of them are gone. I, I don't have, even Babe, he's gone. Yeah. And can you tell me, you mentioned that there was one of the miners that was uh, Yaki. Yeah, that was Marcus and uh, Kusus, his dad. They were Yaki Indians. Yeah. Uh, Marcus was well educated. He could talk, but his dad, uh, uh, old Casus, he couldn't. Hit. And uh, 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 we had a miner, John Garber, and he was always pestering Casus. Uh, and Casus uh, uh, was pretty superstitious, and John would say. Do you hear that, Kazoos? <laughs> you know, and he was just aggravating him all the time, but they was good friends, even yet. <laughs> yeah, and uh, uh, Kazoos, uh, the mine got after him. He had a whole bunch of checks that he hadn't cashed. And they said, they got after him and said, you got to put that money in the bank. you got to uh, cash those checks. And he said, oh, no, bank's no good. He remembered 29 when the banks went broke. He might have had a little money in there. <laughs> but he was a good guy, too. Marcus was, too. Johnny Hernandez, I worked with him, and then he quit and went to Baghdad and uh, as a bookkeeper. A lot of them quit and, and went down there. Frank Williams, he quit at the Iron King and went down to Baghdad and went to work. A lot of them did. Because uh, most of that then was uh, open. Pit. Open pit's a lot safer than underground. At underground, you never knew when you was going to get hurt. I got things all over me that's been banged and battered. And 